It's Chris Goff with the Ruth Chris Real Estate Team here at Bonjour Cafe. It's a little slice of heaven, a boutique French cafe located in the heart of Katy across Taylor High School off of Kingsland and West Green Boulevard. Folks, this is a one-of-a-kind uh, French culinary experience. You're not going to find food like it anywhere in the Katy area. I'm excited because we're here, we're going to have an inside look at some of the food, the dishes, uh, the desserts, uh, and we're even going to have an interview one-on-one -on -one behind the scenes with Chef Arnoud himself, the man that keeps this place humming. Uh, he's the person that comes up with these recipes on a daily basis. Uh, so uh, I'm excited for you. Let's go have a look. Chef Arnaud here, folks. Uh, the man, the myth, the legend, he makes Bonjour Cafe authentic. So, Chef, uh, I'm sure our, our viewers are curious to know, uh, where are you originally from and how long have you been cooking? Uh, I'm from uh, La Rochelle in France. Uh, it's a small, tiny city uh, on the west coast, in the middle of the west coast, below to Normandy. Okay. I'm sure most of the people know Normandy. It's a very tiny village. A uh, lot of beach, port city, uh, so I grew up on the beach, uh, the feet in the sun, and uh, this is who I am. I met my wife in France, she was in vacation, uh, it's like that I ended up here. Uh, I was not, uh, it wasn't my plan to come here and... Uh, but she came because of her. I came yes. because of her, yeah, she bring me, yeah. love, love bring me here. So I was just cooking at home, I was not a chef yet, I was cooking at home for my wife, uh, okay. for family, and my wife, every meal I made, I make, uh, every time she was like, wow, my God, <laughs> I need to go to school for this, and it's like that uh, the journey uh, started uh, for me. Happy wife, happy wife, right? Exactly. <laughs> With my family, my wife, and my kids, we live in KD actually, uh, actually I live uh, next to it, I come uh, by my security in the morning, there you are. Eco friendly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but uh, everyone told us your concept, your food, your pastry, you have to open in Galeria, you, you will do a big success. And we didn't want to do that. We live in KD, we love KD so much. People are so great, and uh, we wanted to, to give that to the community, to, to be part of the community, to. To, to bring this beautiful food, fresh and uh, kind of healthy uh, to, to our community. So that's why we decided like to stay here in KD and the food. Every plate, every meal, even for the dessert, we try to make a, a special presentation, a beautiful presentation. The truffle mashed potato. Again, the truffle yeah, mashed potato. Yeah. Mm. That looks good. Wow. Fresh. We try to stay as well, very simple. I mean, we are not a big restaurant, we are just a small cafe. But we try to bring this small special touch to this special small restaurant. Perfect little French onion, I love French onions. Uh, homemade tomato sauce, of course. Everything yeah. is homemade. Huh? That looks good. I mean 95%. <laughs> <laughs> and what is that? This is a balsamic reduction. Okay. Just for the decoration. It's not even for the taste. It's mainly for the decoration. There's the famous red pepper seasoning. <laughs> Piment d'Espelette, very French. Wow, look at that. That looks good. Wow, bon appetit, folks. Professional crepe maker. She's been making up her whole life. 
I mean, it doesn't get much better than this. I am salivating. Look at this a Suzette sauce. It looks incredible. Bonjour Cafe's authentic crepe right here. I'm about to dig into it, folks. I'm excited. Ooh, look at this. Wow. Look at that fresh steamy. It's gonna be hot, chef. I have a feeling. But I'm ready to brave it. Let's go. <laughs> Such good. Wow. You can taste the freshness, the cheese. Chef, that cheese is fantastic. Wow. Mm. You gotta try this, folks. You want to get your camera? Thank mm -hmm. you, Chef. Truffle mashed potato? Truffle mashed potatoes, folks. Uh, this is a first for me. Mm. Very hot. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm sorry. Creamy, rich in flavor. Oh, my goodness. You can really taste the truffle in there. It just adds a little bit of a, a little zip, a little punch. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm. Excellent, folks. You gotta try this. One. So, chef, this is the Suzette crepe. This right is here? the Suzette crepe uh, orange and grand marnier sauce. Okay. Beautiful. And then this one right here, you said, is the. It's a tart I made today with. Uh, I find some beautiful plum. No. Uh -huh. so I made the uh, almond cream and plum tart wow. with. Uh, a scoop of ice cream on top. This looks really good, Jeff. Wow. Oh my goodness, look at this. So, soup of the day, uh, special uh, Thanksgiving. Uh, sweet potato, onion, carrot, uh, and apple. Wow. Uh, with some homemade crouton, of course. Oh yeah, look at the bread, this is beautiful. Wow, let me take a quick. So this is a seasonal uh, soup for uh, the next month. So chef, I'm, I'm sure everyone wants to know, what do you enjoy most about being a chef? What inspires you? So what I like the most is to be able to create. Uh, that's why, for example, here at Bonjour Café, I didn't create a menu for the pastry. Uh, like that, I, I leave the windows open to my creativity, to the to the seasonal fruits, whatever I have in the supermarket, and uh, I'm able to create whatever I want every day. I don't have a menu with uh, eclair, uh, strawberry tart, and every day I make the same thing. No, I come here and I say, okay, mm -hmm. today let's make this. It's very creative, very authentic, and original. Exactly. Yeah. That's why in my menu as well, I have a lot of uh, of the day, fish of the day, sandwich of the day, like that we change the ingredients. What's fresh, what's on the market, what's... Uh, so something new all the time, folks. Almost, yeah. yeah. Like the soup, soup of the day, every every two, three weeks we make a new soup. Okay. With a seasonal uh, vegetable. So this is the concept of Mondo Yeah, Yeah, it's, it's custom tailored, it's what you wanted. Right? Exactly. Yeah, and, and just for our audience, when they come to your restaurant here, your cafe, what, what, what should they expect? Thanks, <laughs> Authenticity. Authenticity, yeah. 